In regular expressions, there are special characters like the question mark, the plus sign, and the asterisk sign, which can be used for quantifiers in the patterns that you create. Sometimes it can be confusing how these quantifiers are different, so in this video, I'll be using examples to explain the difference between these three quantifiers. For the regular expressions I'll be using in this video, I'll be testing them on this website, rejects101.com. On this website, you can have your regular expression here, and you can have your test string here, and you can see the matches in that string string for the pattern. Now in summary, the difference between these quantifiers is that the question mark quantifier matches 0 or 1 of a character. The plus sign quantifier matches 1 or more of a character. And the last one, the asterisk sign quantifier matches 0 or 1 or more of a character. Now let's look at examples for each of them. Let's start from the question mark quantifier. Let's say we have a test string like it is 1 apple and 2 two oranges and then for the rejects pattern we have e s and question mark and i'll come here and add the global flag so that we can get multiple matches as you can see in the result here the e in apple is matched and the e s in oranges is also matched and in our pattern we have the question mark just after s so what does this mean using this question mark quantifier on s would match e when there is no s that is when there is zero 0s and it would also match es when there is one s as you can see this is the first one e there is no s here es we have one s but if i come here and i add multiple s's you can see that the remaining s's are not matched that's why i said that the quantifier matches zero or one of a character so you can look at this quantifier as it does a does not exist or exists only once match now let's move to the plus sign quantifier i'm going to clear all of this string here and I'm going to clear this pattern here. In this test string, I'm going to have it is one apple, two oranges, and three grapes. And for the grapes, I'm going to have four S's. So for my pattern, I'm going to have E, S, and plus. Like I said, with the plus quantifier, it matches one or more of a character. Since we use this plus sign on this S, it means it's going to match one occurrence of S in ES or is going to match multiple occurrences of S that starts with E. And as you can see in the results here, it matches ES in oranges and it matches ESSSS, which is like multiple S's in grapes. But as you can see in this apple here, it doesn't match this because this quantifier matches one or more, not zero. So you can look at this quantifier as it does a exist once or exist multiple times match. Now let's move to the last special character which is the asterisk sign. I'm going to leave this example here but I'm going to clear this pattern. So let's say we have a pattern E, S and then we have asterisk. Like I said with the asterisk sign the quantifier here matches 0 or 1 or more of a character. So as you can see by using this asterisk on S that means it's going to match a 0 occurrence of S which starts with E or it's going to match a one occurrence of S which starts with E or it's going to match multiple occurrences of S that starts with E and as you can see in the result here this E here is matched this is zero occurrence of S this ES in oranges is also matched this is one occurrence of S and then this ESSS is also matched which is multiple occurrences of S so you can look at this quantifier as it does a does not exist exist only once or exist exist multiple times match. It is important to know which one to use when creating your rejects patterns because sometimes you want to check if a character does not exist or it only exists once. Some other times you want to check if it exists one or multiple times and in some cases you may want to check if it does not exist or if it exists once or if it exists as many times as possible. So it's important to know the differences between these quantifiers to help you create the right rejects patterns. If you enjoyed this video please give it a like, share and subscribe for more videos like this.